Hello everyone, welcome to another GoHog episode and this time we're gonna see Kyle from my base tearing down this base for 3 stars so not the most amazing base because there are no reasonable possible location for double giant bomb there, there's one over here and one over here but this one is not reasonable at all so basically one spot and it's pretty sure that the Teslas are gonna be over here but again this one is a cleanup attack so he knows that there are no double giant bombs at all they're only single bombs and that makes this base very perfect for a gohog attack what's gonna be interesting about this one is that he's gonna use a trick that I call sometimes the walking king I probably never called it and just made it up but never mind just call it the walking king and the whole idea is gonna be going with a kill squad towards the queen he's gonna do it from this direction with two golems wizards are gonna funnel of course He's gonna drop a jump spell over here after breaking the first wall and this is gonna get him to the queen and he's not gonna use the king in the kill squad at all. You can definitely do that if you if you got high level heroes. Even with one hero you can do a lot of damage to a base. So what he's gonna do is going to the queen in this way with the archer queen only, those two golems and few wizards. And the next step is gonna be dropping the king that's gonna be BK over here. The king is gonna go, he's gonna walk through this area and take attention from all of those defenses on the way. And this way he's gonna be able to send the hogs through the base and take them out. He can heal very nicely because he knows where the bombs so this base is gonna go down very nicely. So let's see the attack. So starting with the golems, I was wrong a bit, he's using 3 golems and this is something that people in our clan use a lot. Using 3 golems that gives a lot of tanking for the queen because notice that he goes from the, let's call it long direction to the queen. It doesn't really matter because the queen is pretty much centered so you can come from pretty much every part of the base. but this is what he's doing and notice that he's using the queen in the kill squad because if there's a dragon in the clan castle you definitely can't use the king only it might be a huge problem to get the base unless you're bringing some extra wizards in the kill squad so he didn't bring a lot of wizards and used only few of them so that's why he couldn't use the king instead of the queen in other cases, if there is no dragon in the clan castle, you can use the king. It's it's more effective, I think, in killing the, ar the archer queen, but it doesn't really matter. So, notice how the king is going through the base, and this will allow those hawks taking out some defenses without taking any hits from them. And now we can release the rest of the hawks on the rest of the defenses, heal up that dense area. There are a lot of defenses over there. So you gotta drop the heal spell in the right spots. And king is still alive, queen is still alive. Notice that this base is almost maxed as well and all of the defenses are down now. And 40 seconds are left for the cleanup. So hope you like it. If you did, like, subscribe and comment. And we will see each other in the next video. Bye bye.